Please be there. Yes, man. Oh my god, okay. Hey everyone, today I'm playing GeoGuessr, but the map is completely blank. No labels on here at all, so let's see if I can get any perfect scores. This is done using the Unity script, by the way, which is a fantastic GeoGuessr plugin that has dozens of modifications like this. Highly suggest to check it out, link in the description. This first map up here is called I Saw the Sign. It has locations which have city names very prominently visible and other clues so you can get perfect scores without moving. So the first one here, we can see that we are in Ponce, Puerto Rico, so we also have street names here too. So now comes the task of trying to pinpoint in the city. I think I can find the city. It, it should be this right here, <laughs> I'm pretty sure. But now we gotta try to figure out which streets are which here. I don't know how we're gonna do this. Because not only are the streets not labeled, but the businesses either. So we can't really use this historic museum either, we can't use anything like that. Now what we can try to use is this parking lot. We can also try to use the angle of streets, the shapes of buildings nearby, like I assume we're in the historic old town here. So yeah, I would click right here for now, and I do see this parking lot here in a corner. Now if the street to the south of us makes a little bit of a, an angle there, it looks like it does, sort of like on the map here, so I think that's gonna be it, I'm pretty sure. That's just assuming this location is right in the downtown historic district, which I would assume it is with the museum, so we're gonna go for that, let's see if we get it. Okay, great start here. Let's go, man. I think that was a pretty easy one as far as this map goes. You can get some pretty tricky rounds on here, so let's see what our next one's gonna be. Okay. Oh, man, we're gonna be in Sweden here, so Klintahamen and Ronahamen. I had never heard of these places. I'm not sure I know where those are. Now, if we were playing normally, I would just scan Sweden and try to find these places, but that that's not happening, is it? How am I gonna do this? What can I use? I mean, it doesn't look very northern in Sweden. It looks pretty southern, I would say. I'd guess that we're maybe over here somewhere. But I've just never heard of these cities, don't know where they are. So yeah, I'm gonna go right here in this town and hopefully that's somehow close, let's see. Oh, it's- oh my god, that makes so much sense, man. And as far as Sweden goes, not the worst guess ever, so we'll take that. But yeah, I just never heard of those towns, so nothing I can really do there. Alright, this one, we are in the US here. Jenna Municipal Building. Never heard of this town either, crap. Well, let's at least try to figure out the state here and see if we can work our way up from there. Oh, this is helpful. Jenna L.A. So we're in Louisiana. Okay. Well, that's something. We have our state. Uh, anything else here? We have a, a road, Louisiana 8. Okay. And that's really all we're gonna get, isn't it? So, yeah, just like the other round, I don't know how I'm gonna find Jenna in Louisiana. I just gotta make sure I'm actually clicking in Louisiana. That, that should be it right there. Doing this no moving is hard, because we could move and try to find bigger roads that I know where they are. Like, I know this is Interstate 20. And just try to find directions to other towns that I know, but yeah, for this, I just kind of have to click in the middle and hope it's close. It's actually not bad. And here is Jenna. 473 for just clicking the middle of the state is actually pretty good. That's really lucky, I'd say. So, two more rounds here. Let's see if we can get one more 5k. We started out strong. It was really lucky to get this one. Yeah, I don't think that's happening. Tiyatiyaning Primary School. Okay. That's, uh, I'm never finding this. Well, we should be in South Africa here, right? Actually, looking at that mountain, I think we're more in Lesotho. And that, that place name, I was thinking... Okay, Lesotho maybe is manageable. Maybe we can try to scan for it. And I just realized we can't find the town name. No, so we can't, we can't be scanning, but this is Lesotho here. The, the ring road around the country kind of helps with, like, where the border would be. Yeah, this one, I don't know, I don't think I can really do it. We just gotta click kind of there and hope it's good. That's not bad. That's Tiyatiyaning. Now, again, just like playing normally, we could find that town for sure, but I've never heard of that. Feels like maybe something I should have heard of, but last round here, let's see what we get. Oh, we're back in the U.S., and this is Kermit. Oh, I know this town. That's in Texas. Can I find it, though? How do I do this? So, that's gonna be El Paso. I know Kermit is somewhere in here. That's Midland Odessa here. That's Picos. So where's Kermit? Is this Kermit? Let's try to line up the street here, check the grid of a few towns. I want a 5k this one. So this road's going like this, this angle. So we got that, and then anything else. Let's check some towns. I mean, this street angle here, that fits pretty much. It is, right? If we assume we're on the main street, we've got this larger grocery store set back a bit from the street. There is another street there, or like the grocery store entrance. And then, yeah, the street there. We gotta get the grocery store, if this is the town. Maybe here. Actually, if this is Kermit, that kind of fits. You got the two lanes of parking, you got the store set back, we have the businesses on the corner here. Do these buildings line up? That does work. That does work across from us south. Alright, I think I might have it. I really hope so. Let's end on the 5k. Hell yeah, man. I'm so happy with that. Let's go. Honestly, not disappointed with my efforts there. That was pretty fun. I'm gonna try this again and see if we can get any better seeds than that, but this is just tricky. You really just have to know where towns are to get this. 
Next round, this is Stockholm. Awesome to get this. I'm gonna be in Stockholm this October for the GeoGizzard World Cup. Super excited. Now, I was also in Stockholm last summer, and I don't know if I was in this part of the city, but this is kind of cool. We got a big city to try and pinpoint. Let's see if I can make it happen. And the blank map is gone. Okay, I'm not gonna zoom in too far yet. Let me get this blank map back. Okay, there we go. I had to switch the setting. So, street here we can see is going very, very slightly northwest. Pretty much north-south, though. Looks like a pretty central area of the city. And then we got this, like, sort of pedestrian walkway through here. Alright, let's try to do this. Now, I know this area is a pretty big shopping district, modern buildings and stuff, so we could be in something like this. The grid angle fits beautifully there as well, so I do like that. Maybe something like this corner. Does the street do a little zigzag up there? I don't think it does. Let's try to see what happens down the street. There's a building overhanging the road. I wonder if that shows up in the map. Because that, that's really interesting, this H&M store, like, across the road. That's gotta show up, right? Although maybe that's what this is? Can that work? No, that doesn't make sense. Because no, the street keeps going for a while. We can't, we can't see it ending, so no, we gotta be more... I think maybe this is it, honestly. But, and here, there's, here this shows an underground road. There's some tunnel underneath us. I mean, there's no way we can tell that that's here, but maybe it's this instead. Oh wait, yeah, look! There's the building overhanging! It is here on the map. Okay, that's gonna be it then. Okay, we're gonna move there. Hopefully 5k in Stockholm. Let's see it. Yes, okay, good start. So let's go to round number two. Okay, what is this? Oh, Osorno. Oh, I've heard of this town. It's in Chile, I know this. It says Chile here. Osorno. Oh, we can do this. I just gotta try to remember which one is Osorno. It's a little bit south, right? It's somewhere in here. Is it this one? I think that's Temuco, actually. Oh, we can do this. Let's try to, again, check the street grid. This seems pretty central. Yeah, this is a big bus station here. So we can look for that in the city. On a street like this, curving around slightly. Going southeast here, and keeping on curving over there. I'm pretty confident that this is Temuco, so I'm not gonna look there. Maybe it's this one. I just don't know if it's north or south of Temuco. Alright, checking in the downtowns for the bus station road that curves around like this doesn't seem good here. I'm gonna say that's not it. Let me check something south. Is that... I don't think it's more coastal like that. So maybe this is of Sorno? I could see this. Is that the bus terminal? There is absolutely no way. Hold on. We do have that little building here. The angle of the street fits? Did I get it? Come on, come on. I gotta go for it. Come on, please be a Sorna, please be there. Yes, man, oh my god, okay. On to round three. So far, we have a perfect score going into round three. Next one. Topeka, this is Kansas. Okay, we can get this for sure. So, Topeka is this. I think that's Topeka, yeah. Because that's, yeah, that's Kansas City, yeah. Easily here, okay. So we're next to the police station, and what else do we have here? Looks like downtown is a little bit south of us, so... Okay, that's gonna put us more here. Kinda like the round we just had, we gotta use the angle of street and the building shape and everything to tr try to line this up. See, so yeah, it's gotta be something like in here. So this is sort of a standalone building, it's got a big parking lot next to it, so we're set back from the street a bit. Street's up to the northwest. There's another gap in the buildings here on the other street, and then a parking lot, so that's another thing to look for. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be... oh, maybe this. Yeah, that'll be it, that'll be it. Yeah, because we got this building coming up right to the street front, and then this one's set back a bit. Yeah, that makes sense on the map here, so... We are going to be lined up with this building across, so yeah, about there. Checking on the police station building, that, that fits. If we 25k this seat, I'll be so happy. There we go, Topeka, round number four. Please be doable for me. Oh, what is this? Oh, it's Senegal. Oh, no. Kadugu. Oh, I think I've heard of this. Where is Kadugu? I have to at least try. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this, but at this point, we have to try. Here's Senegal. Where is Kadugu? I have no idea. Alright, well, let's think about what we have here again. We gotta line up the street. It's going southeast here, very slightly. Big gradual curve around through what I assume, again, is the center of town, or close to it. And it's probably connected to a main road. Like, this is probably a main end road, I would guess. So far, I've really only seen the first town, which actually doesn't fit, because we don't have the curve here. It's going the wrong way. But that angle of street is just what stood out to me. There's one other town I thought could possibly work. I think it's up north here. This one. But I'm not sure that it really makes sense. We need to have this big gendarmerie here, which I don't really see on the map. That doesn't seem to make sense. At this point, I don't know that I'm going to find it. I, yeah, I just have no clue, honestly, what Kadugu is. So I'm going to leave it in this town. Hopefully that's even in Senegal. Please, by some miracle, be correct. No, it's not at all. Oh, that's down here. I should have known that. 
I didn't check here. Oh man, that's brutal. Last round here, let's see if we can end on one more 5k. It's a city, but is it a city I've heard of? I have not seen the sign. <laughs> is this the sign? Oh, Commune di Rovigo. Yeah, that's- I've never heard of that. That's- it's Italy for sure, but I don't know where that is. We had a great start. I could have gotten the Senegal if I scanned longer, but last round Italy, this is impossible. I have no clue where to begin with this. I'd say maybe it's north. Close to Milan. We're gonna just do this and then try a couple more maps, so don't go anywhere, and let's see what else we get. It is north, it's Po Valley. Second game there, a little bit of a worse score, but three five cases to start really nice, so let's try a couple more maps, see what else we can make happen here. Next up, we're trying my hometown of Chicago, and we're playing on Intersection Guessers, so we get street corners every time. Hopefully, we can use the street signs, and I can figure this out, but it could be tricky, so let's see what we get here. Make sure the map is blank. It is. Alright, and one of our streets is here. 83rd and Phillips, we're on the southeast side. All right, this could be tough. I don't really know where Phillips is, but thankfully we do have this like stadium here for some school, so that's helpful. And 83rd, so this is 95th, that's 95th. So this is gonna be 87th, 654, 83rd. And we know we're on the east side, so east of here, somewhere, next to a stadium, we can scan for it. Where is it? Is it this? That's gotta be it. Surely. Got the street south of us, T-Junction, that isn't very well labeled as a stadium, but it looks like it is. It looks like that's gonna be it. So, yeah, gotta be there. Excellent start. Okay, got it done there, round number two. So far, so good. Alright, this one I can get for sure. Oakland, Belmont, this is up on the north side. Pretty close to me, actually, so I should be able to get this, no problem, I hope. This is gonna be Irving, so this is... Roscoe... So that's Belmont. Yeah, yeah, that's Belmont. Okay. So now we gotta get Oakley. Oakley's between Western and Damon. So that's Ashland, that's Damon, and that's Western. So I think that's Oakley. Oakley, Levitt, Hoyne. Right? I should really get this just immediately. I've been past here probably two billion times, but yeah, right there should be it. Excellent. Okay, there we go. My neck of the woods there in Chicago. Round number three. Here we go. Oh, this seems doable as well. Division in Cambridge, nice. Oh, I think I've been past here too. But this is good to get. Division in Cambridge, so that's North Avenue. Division is four blocks south, so that's division here. A good distinct intersection here with the T-Junction South, this sort of city farm here. This is a cool location, I like this. I can see the brown line tracks over there too, so that's this. Yeah, we gotta be, is it this maybe? Let's try, I can't really imagine what else it'll be. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so far we're doing great. Two more rounds, let's get this done. Get the 25k. Trip and Addison, uh, again, I should be able to do this. So Addison is this one, and Trip is gonna be... Oh, where's Trip? Trip is like, three. it's 3,000 something to us. And again, it's a T-junction, that's good. So we can use that to our advantage. Oh, there's an angled street, is that Elston, Milwaukee? Probably Milwaukee. Although, no, no, that's not... No, that is Shurus High School. There it is. That's its roof, I think. Okay. It should be here. It should be. And yeah, it's a North T-Junction. I was thinking it was South for some reason. No, no, no. That's good. For sure, we get the angled alley right there. Yeah, it's there. Awesome. Oh, we zero meter it. Hell yeah. All right. Last round here. Let's get it done. Hermitage and 74th. Yeah, 74th. Hermitage 74th. All right, I can do that. So 74th. Now, the tricky part is counting numbered streets, making sure I'm not messing up. That's Garfield, which is 55th, so that's 59th, 63rd, 67th, 71st. That's 75th, so this is 74th, following the tracks. How does that work? Is that right? Hermitage is close to Polina, which is like 1700 west. So, trying to count the streets here. That's Western, so Western Damon. Ashland, yeah, we gotta be like in here. That doesn't seem right. I gotta check the streets again. Let me let me count up from something I know. So we know this is 95th. That's 87th, 3rd, 79th, 8th, 7th, 6th, 5, 4. I miscounted, yeah. Got a couple big warehouse buildings to our south. There's a parking lot. This is like a CTA depot or something. I don't understand. That's a way bigger warehouse than it looks like we have here. And then there's this building. Is that this? But this is, like, designated a park. I don't know about that. <laughs> it doesn't look like a park to me. But, I mean, that fits a little bit better with the way the warehouse is right here. I guess that could extend farther down. We just can't really see it. So, yeah, I mean, that's that's surely it. Come on. 
Fantastic. Okay, 25k in it. We got it done. I'm proud of that for sure. I won't spend too much time in Chicago, but if you guys want to see me do a full video dedicated to this, let me know in the comments if that's something you're interested in. All right, let's end with something that can either go fantastically or terribly. Famous places. Now, can I even recognize these to begin with, let alone find them on the map? Let's see. Hopefully, I won't make a fool of myself here. Round number one. Oh, what is this? Is this Venice? No, this isn't Venice. We got the flag of Croatia. Is this Dubrovnik, then? Oh god, okay. <laughs> really hope so. Let me check Dubrovnik if I can find it. Is it this? This. That's Dubrovnik. So, angled in a pedestrian walkway street like this here. Pretty long plaza. Maybe we're more like in here. Yeah, this seems more like the old town. I, I got nothing, honestly. I'm just gonna click there. I hope this is even Dubrovnik. It is. Oh, we got the 5k. Let's go. <laughs> Hell yeah. A little stroke of luck there. I'm very happy with it, though. I'm just happy I found Dubrovnik and even recognized it. Round number two. Oh, this is beautiful. Is this that Belarus coverage? Uh, maybe not. What the hell is going on here? It does remind me of the Belarus thing. The Museum of Books. Yeah, no, I'm pretty sure this is here. In Minsk. The one tracker coverage in Minsk. So I think that's Minsk here. Is that Minsk called? <laughs> I gotta make sure I'm... Yeah, I mean, if that's... Yeah, yeah, that surely is. Okay. Should be able to find this huge church and everything. I know it's close to the river. I can't figure it out. I'm just gonna go there. It's not the Minsk coverage. Oh no, it's the Kiev coverage. Oh god. That's kind of bad. Especially considering current geopolitics. Round number three. Oh, Jesus. Okay. What is this one? Am I supposed to know what that is? Probably. Is that the Brandenburg Gate, actually? I think it is. This looks like Berlin. Yeah, that's the TV tower. Okay. Let's try to get this. I hope that's what this is. So, Berlin is this. That's Berlin here. I think the gate is... Oh, that's... What am I talking about, man? I don't know what this is. No, it's here. It's here. It's that. Absolutely there. If I can trust this photosphere, it looks like we can. We're there. Okay, good. Alright. That is the Brandenburg Gate. Oh my god. That would have been quite embarrassing if I didn't get that one, so we'll take that one. Alright, number four here. Okay, this is a cool castle on top of a hill. Have I been here? No. No, I have not, but this is Scotland. We have the Scottish flag. No, maybe I have been here. Also, crazy to see the stadium built so close to this old castle. That's really, really interesting. This reminds me a lot of Stirling. Ah, oh, what is this? It's, it, that can't be right. That can't be right. Could have, no, we got water and stuff here. This is not, not correct. Is it Edinburgh Castle? Maybe it's that. Yeah, this has got to be better. Oh, this is showing my terrible knowledge, man. This is embarrassing. We got to be in here, right? Is there a stadium? I mean, yeah, that's that has to be it. I don't. So I just don't see the stadium. I can't figure this out, man. I I gotta go there. I don't. Understand. Yeah, where's the stadium? Okay. I'm, I'm really confused by that, but 4999, I at least figured it out in the end there. Round number five, here we go. Oh, this is that church in Colombia. I don't know where it is, though. I got no clue where this is, but I recognize it. Built onto this bridge, that's so cool. But yeah, I have no clue where in Colombia this is, so... Honestly, I couldn't do this even if I had labels on the map, so I'm just gonna click there. And we'll, we'll be okay. Oh, it's south, yeah. Well, ending on a not-so-good one there, but we started out decently, except for Ukraine. That's kind of bad, too. But you know what? We'll take it. Not a terrible effort. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick video of playing with a blank map. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe, and I will catch you guys in the next one.